Sunday, Brian and his 28-person team spend a full eight-hour day on the range. With practice comes perfection, and with perfection, of course, comes American Chunker. All clear downrange? All clear. This year, Brian isn't satisfied with just winning. Together with his crack team of scientists and engineers, he is aiming for the Pumpkin Chunkin' Holy Grail. The Holy Grail, of course, is the mile, um, and it's been rolling up on 27 years now and nobody's hit the mile. 20 seconds. One mile is 5,280 feet, or 17 and a half football fields. Fire in a hole. And would smash the previous world record by over 700 feet. <laughs> Brian hopes that one key upgrade will give him the extra punch he needs to make the mile. This year, we've added a new compressor, which is just second to none. This 540 horsepower compressor puts 500 pounds of pressure per square inch behind each flying pumpkin. This is a monster. This machine will be the difference between first and second place this year. But will it be enough? To hit the mile, the team needs to increase their average speeds by well over 100 miles an hour and break through the sound barrier. Trying to accelerate a pumpkin to the speed of sound is unheard of. Nobody has ever tried to do this. Nobody has had the means to do this. This is the they do at NASA. The sound barrier is right at 770 miles an hour. So that, that's our target. But throwing a pumpkin at such high speed involves a huge risk. The scary part with the sonic limit is, usually when something breaks through the sound barrier, if it's kind of wimpy in structure, which a pumpkin actually is, it's apt to pie. Pumpkin pie is a chunking term used to describe a pumpkin blowing apart before it hits the ground. Pumpkin pie is the voodoo word in pumpkin chunking. You don't want anything to do with pumpkin pie. Here we go. Team American Chunker has spent $168,000 and over 2,800 man hours building up to this moment. All right, step back. Fire it all. <laughs> Get Leo on that radar for a check out at the barrel. The pumpkin traveled so fast that the naked eye could not detect whether it survived the shot. So Brian has to analyze high speed footage to be sure he did not pie. Right where the pumpkin comes out of the barrel, that's the most critical spot for deformation. Did you see any of that coming out the end of the barrel at all? You'll see as it flies through the shot. No deformation whatsoever. That is just absolutely yeah, and, incredible. And even... Playing back at 1,500 frames per second, the footage is conclusive. No pie. But did it break the sound barrier? So how'd we look? We're really close to our goal, but we got to hit it harder. All right. Here we go. Two seconds. This next shot will push American Chunker's machine, not to mention the pumpkin, to near its absolute limit. Fire and hole. Fire and hole. If Brian can't take his team supersonic, he can kiss his dreams of the mile goodbye. 